So welcome KVSK right JE classes. Today I would like to bring one of the important thing in matrices. So it is very useful for CBSC point of view and also JE lines. So here is elementary operations on a matrix. So what is the importance of elementary operations on a matrix? They are very useful to find inverse of the matrix and also it helps a lot while solving system of equation without using elaborate calculations. So today I would like to bring three important elementary operations on a matrix. I am giving as a symbol transformation 1 and transformation 2, third one is transformation 3. So here the first one transformation 1 is interchange of any two rows or columns. Interchange of any two rows or columns. So if you want to go in terms of row wise, interchange of 5th row and j row interchange of 5th row and j row i can do the same thing on column also on column also as a symbol ci in between i am using some symbol cj interchange of column i and column j for example matrix a is given by 1 2 3 first row 1 2 3 second row 0 1 3 third row 4 5 6 on this matrix what i am doing interchange r1 with elements of r2 so from this I get the new matrix of the form 0, 1, 3, R2 become R1 and R1 becomes R2 here 0, 1, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I am transforming one matrix with the other matrix that means there is no change in the nature of the matrix just you are getting change in matrix only. When you come to second transformation T2 so here multiplication of a row or a column by some constant uh, replacing one row elements or one column elements with multiplying some constant k. As a symbol, replacing ith row by k times of ith row, or you can say replacing elements of column i with k times of column j. For example, matrix A is given by 1, 2, 0 and 1, minus 1, 1 and 3, 4, 5. 3, 4, 5. On this, what I am doing? Replacing R1 by row 1 elements by 2 times of R1. That means multiplying this row elements with multiplying this row elements with 2. So now the new matrix of the form, this is 2, it becomes 4, it becomes 0, and 1 minus 1, 1, and 3, 4, 5. The same thing I can do on the column also. So this is transformation 2. When you come to transformation 3, so what it says adding elements of uh, adding elements of one row adding elements of one row with the elements of with the elements of other row with the elements of other row by multiplying some constant by multiplying some constant k multiplying some constant k so if I, if I want write by using simple replacing i throw i throw elements by i throw elements plus k times of j throw elements. So this is a symbol I can use on the rows. Similarly, if I want to write the same symbol on by using columns means ci replaced by ci plus k times of cj k times of cj. For example, 